Arkady Viachanin, uh, champion in the 100 Bachelor tonight, 53-69. First of all, Arkady, uh, let's talk about that time a little bit. Um, pretty solid in-season swimming. How does that compare to what you've been doing so far this year? Yeah, it's, it's the best I had in-season, and uh, I'm happy with, this, with, the, with the time, but actually uh, felt a little bit a uh, little bit different than in the morning. I guess I felt a little bit uh, more solid in the morning. I mean, my, my technique and the, uh, the stroke, stroke connection. Um, so I guess I lost uh, this uh, feeling just because it was a little bit higher tempo than in the morning and so that might have been even faster but that's okay because like I said I'm happy with the timing. It's a little bit faster than I had in Mesa so um, I'm excited about 200 tomorrow. Do you attribute that speed to anything? Just training going well? Uh, yeah, it's all going well. I'm just uh, I dropped uh, weights a little bit this week. I still I still have like two sessions with those light. And, uh, that that was that is uh, what gives me that a little bit extra speed. I, I mean, I'm still I'm still still going out slower than uh, some guys, but I mean, 262 is still pretty fast for me. Yeah, so it's it's nice. When you see you're going to be in a heat like that with guys like Ryan and with David Plummer and with a guy that's been a world champion before in Koga, does that get you a little more excited to come here? Does that change your approach at all a little bit? Uh, yeah, of course. It's uh, it's nice to uh, race with them because it's uh, it's a strong field, and uh, I was uh, I was happy that uh, David was under 54 as well. <laughs> yeah, he, he went quite few, almost the same time he had last year, and uh, this year 53 nine. It's really good in season two. So, uh, and it's uh, it's a great race uh, also because uh, so so many so many really fast guys. And actually, Ryan was uh, so close to me on uh, third uh, twenty-five. I was like, am, am I doing something wrong? Or like, and then uh, then he uh, I guess he he got tired. And uh, but I got tired as well. But uh, I mean, it's just uh, kind of. Uh, a funny way to swim the race and you you see someone next to you and you're like oh come on I gotta get faster is it always a little scary to have a guy like that come you know with those underwaters and that third 25 he has it to see him coming like that even though you have pretty pretty solid underwaters as well I, I think our speed is equal mm -hmm. on that so uh, yeah it's uh, I mean when I when I got uh, to uh, to Florida uh, three and a half years ago I have uh, Ryan taught me a little bit about the breakout so I'm, I'm uh, kind of using his his knowledge a little bit on that. And, I mean I just uh, he told me just a simple thing but uh, I, I, I wasn't using that uh, to hold my body so it's it's kind of nice to understand that it's not like I was weak or something it's just uh, kind of the way of uh, understanding how to use your strength in a proper way. So it's uh, people watching this probably can't see. If you're pointing to your abs, is it something that with your body that you're changing your breakout, like you engaging your abs a little more? Yeah, it's uh, just the power of uh, kind of middle, this middle section, mm -hmm. a little bit of thighs and uh, mm -hmm. core. So that's, that's the key and uh, just people just have to feel it. So You got that 200 tomorrow. But, you know, we, you can argue over which, which event's been better for you over, you know, your, your career, but what are you looking at for that event? What's going to be a solid marker for you uh, at this point? Um, the goal is the same as for, for the 100. Uh, the time time faster than I had in Mesa would be all right. Mm -hmm. and, uh, th th this, is a, this is a little bit faster pool than in Mesa. And it's uh, indoors, so it should be more comfortable. Does that make a big difference for you in backstroke? Uh, yeah, it, it does because uh, in Mesa I was I wasn't slow, but uh, I, I still was really close to the lane line. Right. I didn't I didn't hit it in the, in the final hit, but it's still, <laughs> it's still it's still it's still good to be in the middle of the lane. Yeah. So um, th this summer you're not going to World Championships. Yeah. What's going to be your uh, what, what what's your big focus mean? Uh, U.S. Nationals. Okay. Yeah. Yes, Nationals, and uh, I'm, I'm skipping Santa Clara mm -hmm. because I have to go to Serbia, and uh, I'll be in um, uh, Open de France again, just like last year. Okay. And then uh, I'll have a Serbian Nationals, so I'm, I'm skipping Santa Clara just because I'll have enough mm -hmm. uh, races. Are there any time goals you're looking at for the summer to be to be at? And are you going to try and compare your times to what those guys are doing up in Russia at the World Championships? Uh, I mean. 
it's it's good to see that they uh, they improved a little bit on backstroke, but it's also kind of uh, uh, frustrating to see some some guys that were fast last year they aren't there anymore somehow. But I guess that's uh, uh, I don't know maybe something to do with uh, experiments they're doing in the training process or whatever. But uh, and. I'm. I'm not comparing. I'm just. I'm just thinking about my own, and uh, I have my goal in mind. Uh, so you know, just why Serbia? Yeah, I, I know it's been a while since you made that decision, but what made that feel such like the right decision? They were the only ones uh, who were willing to help with the citizenship process, mm -hmm. and they they just made it really fast, and and uh, actually. Uh, they, um, they're really close to Russia culture yeah. as, as a country, and uh, they they know me, and uh, they were supportive all the way, and they're supportive now. They respect Greg Troy. They mm -hmm. respect me. They uh, they understand that the necessary things I have to do in my training process. So that's pretty much it. That's how it's sh how it's supposed to be in the first place. So. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, thanks, Arkady. Good luck in that 200 tomorrow. Thank thanks. You.